What's up, fellas? It's your boy Wings of Redemption, and I'm back and bringing you another video here today. And I'm gonna go ahead and say I'm pulling out the 6v6. Well, me personally, the 6v6 can still go on. I'm just gonna replace myself on the team. There's a couple reasons why. One, I don't play Call of Duty hardly anymore. There's a reason why half the games you see on my channel are from somebody else. It's because um, I haven't really played Call of Duty since January, and like. I don't, I'm not having fun. I'm not, and that's the whole purpose of everything behind. I'm having fun. Of having fun, and like the the teams that got announced, they're better players than me. Quite honestly, I like I, I can easily say this because one, I haven't played seriously since January, and with that being said, some of these guys played like three or four hours a day, and like on a game that I haven't even touched. I have like seven days total on Modern Warfare 3. To give you an idea of how that's different from Black Ops, I had over 30 days on Black Ops. I mean, I just don't like the game, and it just doesn't agree with me. And there's other things out there that I want to do. And there's other things out there I have to do. Like, Saturday, I was supposed to scrim with my team, but I spent the entire day trying to get my brother's car home because uh, somebody had slashed his tires. I mean, and that's the honest truth. I mean, it is what it is. And, um, and like today, what do I got to do today? Today I got to work on my office desk. I can't scrim today. And it is what it is. Like, I am the weakest person on my team. And, like, I'm not even going to kid you. I stand no chance against people that, that, that I'm having to go up against. And it would basically be my team versus another team anyway since... And I would just be there to kind of fill in the slack. It wouldn't be nothing exciting. And I have and people like there like say there's nothing to lose. There's tons to lose in situations like this. And this is the why nobody does it. This is the why nobody why this is why like people like white boy and stuff like that don't do this kind of things. Because these spotlight situations is where you lose your ass off. This is where opinions be made. And I feel like I'm gonna lose subscribers any way I go at this point. The only way I could gain subscribers is to win win the contest and even then it won't matter because black ops 2 is right around the corner so i've concluded that the easy the easiest way is just to go and take the subscriber hit now and move on with my life instead of creating a situation where it might be another syndicate which let, took my channel six to eight months to rebound from the syndicate loss and it is what it is i mean like just just the other day i just seen jay nasty arguing about the maps and now he wants to set the maps up that kind of highlights a rushing style versus and it takes away every it takes away all the camping elements out of the game and it's like I don't have twitch reflexes I don't my channel was based around the idea of how a person that isn't very good at Call of Duty to do well within himself and be a more of an asset of his team I've never been a twitch guy and even though I get I'm pretty good at Call of Duty I'm by no means a professional player I play to have fun, and there's I, and I don't want to play Modern Warfare 3 at this point in this life cycle. I want to play Assassin's Creed 3. I want to play Need for Speed Most Wanted. I want to do all these other things, and um, I'm tired of stressing about this. I've been spent the last four days sick to my stomach trying to figure out the best way to take this 6v6, and I'm tired of stressing about it. So, yeah, pulling out. We can still have it. I will just replace myself with, like, some all. And we can still do it on uh, whenever it happens. I don't know. Peace, guys.